Hello, today we're going to make palitao. It's a Filipino snack or merienda. So we'll start with glutinous rice flour. Or we're gonna make it into galapong by mixing it with water. We have grated coconut or kinaid na yolk, sesame seeds, and sugar. And we'll combine. First, we'll combine water and glutinous rice flour. And we're gonna boil some water. And we'll drop it into the water. And when it floats, it's done. I just added some water onto our glutinous rice flour. Just combine. So when you mix this, you want the consistency where you can form it into an oval thin shape. So if it's too watery, just add more flour flour, glutinous flour and until you get the desired consistency. If it's too watery then you can't form it. So just keep adding flour until you find your right consistency. So we want to form this into this shape. Get a piece and uh, shape it into a bowl like that and press if it cracks just kind of press on it and there you go In the meantime, while you're preparing this, you can boil your water. Have a bowl. it. Now we're gonna drop this to our boiling water here. Drop it one at a time as you can see. It went down. Once it starts to float on the surface, then it's done. Okay, now it's floating on the surface, so it's ready. We're gonna take it out. We 
of our politao, it's done. So we just dip it in our coconut. Very easy snack. It's fun to make, even with kids. I remember when I was in uh, when I was in high school. I think this was one of our projects. Then we're going to sprinkle it with our sugar sesame combination. Like that. Just make sure that your fingers, hands are washed. I actually wash my fingers and hands several times whenever I touch anything I wash again see how beautiful they are and it's homemade easy to make I bought some raw sesame seeds you can eat it as it is raw but I like just for a little bit um, roast it in the pan just very slightly this actually sometimes pops, so just be very careful. Just lightly brown it, brings out the flavor, but don't burn it. Again, you can eat it raw, but I like to toast mine a little bit. Starting to brown a little. Just add some sugar. And our toasted sesame seeds. Just like that. This is our finished product. Delicious palitao, Filipino delicacy.